if you are an end user and you want to install Shelly, then you can go to our website, go to shelly.com and go to the partners list. Here you can find a list of uh, certified Shelly installers or just go to shelly.com slash pages slash installers. You can uh, uh, type your address in and uh, based on your address, you are able to find your closest uh, Shelly installer. And you're also able to see the level of the installer. So if they uh, have the bronze, silver and gold, if you are an installer, you can actually get on this map. Uh, we will show you later on how you get on this map, but basically you just go to our web page and then you sign up uh, to become a Shelly installer. Uh, and again, if you have taken uh, one of our uh, training sessions, one of our courses, the bronze, silver, or gold, you'll be able to show your status on our website so customers can find you. We also have the installer portal. Uh, so if you go to installersportal.chili.cloud, you are able as an installer to sign up there. And when you sign up, you will get your own personal uh, Shelly installer code. With the Shell installer code, you can put this code into your customer accounts. And uh, if the customers allow you to, then you can remote access their accounts. Of course, you cannot change in any personal data or information, but you are able to make remote support and you are able to work on the installations to add new devices, configure new devices, make automations to support your customers. So on this portal right here, you will get an overview of all of your customer installations. More about that later on um, in the installer section. You also have the fleet manager. The fleet manager is a platform for professional business solutions. Uh, there are two ways to use the fleet manager. You can get your own personal cloud or you can install the Shelly fleet manager on your local Nuke, or local uh, Raspberry Pi or similar. And then you are able to add thousands of devices to uh, to one account, you can have different um, different uh, access levels like uh, admin, ad, admins, installers, uh, users, and so on. You can make different dashboards. We have built-in uh, Grafana integration, so you can make very advanced um, energy dashboards. Um, we have built, we have integrated uh, Node.js, so you are able to make very complex uh, automations with Chile devices and third-party devices as well. We have different ways for multi-channel support. One thing is that we have the email support. We also have the Facebook group. So there, uh, there, there's one official uh, Facebook group. There are more than 100,000 members inside this group. And if you go there, if you post your questions, you will, you will get immediately support by, by, by the Shelly users. Sometimes you will even see that our, our CEO Dimitar, Dimitrov uh, will reply you because he's still very active inside the Shelly communities, uh, watching about what does people think about Shelly devices? Are there any problems? Then he makes sure to fix them as soon as possible. You will also be able to find a lot of local Facebook communities. So if you look down in the description, or, or below this video, we will add links to, to most of the Shelly groups. We, we, we might not know about all of them, but, but go there, find your local community, uh, join it. Uh, you'll get, get the opportunity to, 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 to learn from each other down there. If you are a professional installer, you can also find local support information. We don't have local support in all countries yet, but we actually do have local support in many countries. So. Um, down there, we will also add information about local support. Again, this is only for professional support. So professional installers, wholesalers, vocational school teachers, and so on are able to reach out to us for support questions. We have the support portal. So if you go there, you can open a ticket and uh, our, um, our, our technical team will reply to you as soon as possible. We have the community forum, which is our official forum where you can find a lot of information, wiring diagrams, a lot of different stuff there, but you're also able to submit your question there and also get support from, from the official community forum. Um, that's about it. We have some links, useful links here. You can also find the links uh, down below this video. Uh, there's a link here for this Shelly browser app. There's a link for the Shelly community forum. 
for the for the Facebook group for our YouTube page where you can also find some guides and tutorials uh, instruction videos. Uh, this is a link to where you can open the ticket, a link to the installer portal, a link to our FAQ. There's a lot of frequent asked questions down there. Uh, so, so go ahead and read those if you have questions. If you are an integrator, you can also find our API documentation and, and integrate uh, silly device into your own solutions. Uh, we have a li big library of scripting examples. So if you want to, to get started with scripting, you can act actually access this library and find a lot of scripting examples. You can import them, make small edits, and then you are well, up and running with scripting, or at least started. We have the knowledge base. Uh, the now in, inside the knowledge base, you can find all kinds of technical documentation about the devices. You can find wiring diagrams and much, much more. Uh, before we end this session, I would like to quickly show you inside a browser how it looks like. So a few of the most important links might be kb.shelly.cloud. KB is our knowledge base, as I said. Uh, here you can find some, some links. So you can go to the device page if you want to. You can search by generation or uh, by category. And if we go to the Shelly Gen 4 devices, just, an ex just as an example, uh, go to the Shelly 1 PM Gen 4, here you can find a product picture. You can find information about the device model name, a short description. You can find information about the main features. Just scroll down some use cases, uh, internal schematics, uh, information about the connectivity of the devices, safety features. Uh, supported load types. You can find a lot of different information also uh, about the, the, the LEDs behind the device. So uh, what does it mean when it blinks uh, one second on, one second off, and, and so on. You can find physical dimensions. You can find uh, a lot of stuff. But uh, most important is that you can also find the wiring diagrams. So if you have any questions about wiring diagrams, go to kb.shilly.cloud find your Shelly device and here you can find detailed wiring diagrams so it should be straight straight uh, straight out of the box I was about to say it should be simple to, to get started and, and to wire up your Shelly devices uh, if we go back to the knowledge space uh, front page again you can also see there are some solution guides if you go to solution guides uh, you can find a lot of different use case examples um, also here you can find use case examples. If you go to installation guides, you'll be able to find, uh, well, installation tutorials. Let me see, you can find the Shelly Smart uh, Control Guide about the Shelly Smart Control System. But again, we'll come back to this. I will show you how to use the Shelly app uh, and you'll learn from this, uh, this training session. Uh, integrations is very important, especially if you work with Kenex. You can find the complete Kenex documentation. So, which type of devices you will need, how to set up your uh, Kenex IP solutions, uh, and so on. Um, find information about recycling, and also you can find uh, device compliances. Uh, you can also find that if you go to the specific device and, and then there will be a direct link to all of the EU declar declarations in the bottom of the page. Um, one more important thing, if you need technical support, as I said, in some countries we have local support. Uh, if we don't have that, you can go to this support tab up here in the upper right corner. And here you are able to, first of all, to, 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 to browse around articles uh, you can find uh, direct links to installation video guides uh, and uh, the FAQ. But if you still have questions after checking those out, you can submit a ticket right here. And then our technical support team will get back to you very fast.